Failure is easy. Anyone can fail. I'm Bill Snodgrass. In this video, I'm going to talk about three things that anyone can do to make sure they fail. So if we're going to talk about success and failure, it, it goes without saying that we're talking about being successful or failing at something. It, 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 there is a, a an, an object or a thing that that you're trying to uh, uh, accomplish or do you, you you can't not you know in, in in a vacuum success and failure means very very little it, it's it needs to be related to uh, a, a goal or an objective or something you want to do and so that's that's where this conversation is going you you anybody can fail at something you, you have to have something that, that you're going to fail about so that's what we're going to talk about in this video. Uh, we're going to talk about three ways that failure can come. And so uh, let's get started. Let's go do that. If you subscribe to the motivational videos that are available on YouTube, you're going to hear a lot of people say things like, you know, the dramatic music and the great cinematography. And they're going to say, don't let anyone stand in the way of you and your dreams. Don't let anyone tell you your dream is a bad one. Well, this is just not good advice. That's just not. The first way to make sure you fail at something is to set a goal that is unrealistic, to set a goal that is unreachable, to set a goal that makes no sense for the context of your life. And, and, and if you do that, if you set that kind of a goal, you're bound to fail. For example, that's a, that's a telescope. If I said, next spring break my goal for next spring break is to walk across the landscape of mars obviously that's that's not realistic uh, that, that's not a realistic thing not not in the, the the position i am the context of my life to i'm not an astronaut i don't even know any astronauts so to say my goal is to walk across that's a dream, that's a wish, that's a fantasy. That's a delusion. And, and if, I, if I hold on to that, if I hold on to that, then I am bound to fail. There is a fine line between being delusional and being optimistic. And you need people in your life who can help you to sort out the difference between those two things. You need someone who says, listen, you're not, you're not gonna go to Mars next year. You're not gonna be the first person to walk on the face of Mars. You need people in your lives who will help you clarify the, the possibility and the realisticness of the things that you set for, your, for yourself. There are people who will tell you that anything is possible. And that's just not true. There are things that are not possible. There are things that I can set as I can set as as a as a goal that are just not possible. I'm not going to sprout wings and learn to fly like an eagle. It's just not going to happen. Even even more even less fantastic would be I want to play in the NBA and I've used this example before. I'm 56 years old. I'm 5'11". In the very best, 30 years ago, I couldn't have been in the NBA. And you can take the best NBA player you can think of and advance them to the age of 56, they're not gonna be in the NBA. And, and someone needs to probably tell me, if that were my goal, someone probably needs to say, you're not being realistic. That's not an attainable goal. So the, the first way to fail at anything is to pick a thing that is impossible. To pick a thing that is beyond the realm of probability, beyond the realm of possibility. S setting a, a, an unattainable goal is a sure way of failing. The first rule of goal setting is that goals have to be attainable. They have to be measurable, they have to be compatible, and, and you know but the, the, the first rule is it has to be an attainable goal 
If you, if you set your goals that are unattainable, you are surely going to fail. The second way that you can fail at anything is to not have a plan, to not have an idea of how you're going to achieve that. As I said in a previous video, not having a plan to accomplish something doesn't make it a goal, it makes it into a dream, or makes it into a wish. You know, you can wish that you could go to college, but if you don't have a plan, you're not gonna get there. If you don't have a plan, you don't really have a goal. You can have a goal, I suppose, but very quickly you need to add planning in and as a way of getting from point A to point B. Um, a friend of mine uh, made a comment on, on a previous video about planning and rudders and ships. It's like you can't just decide to sail to Australia. There, there, that's, a, that's kind of a wishful dream. It becomes, it becomes a goal when you say, step one, buy a boat. You've got to put some plans in place. And, and, and I deal with a lot of students uh, who are at different stages in, in finding their career. Um, I have a 14-year-old who says that she wants to be a dental hygienist. So I was like, well, how, how, how do you get to become a dental hygienist? And she's like, um, I finished high school and then I go to dental hygiene school. For a 14-year-old, that's the beginning of the bud, that's the developing of a plan. If she were 18 years old, there maybe need some more steps like what college are you going to go to? What dental school? What, what, what? How are you going to pay for it? Where are you going to get the money? How are you going to pay back those student loans, etc., etc., etc.? So, so the plan needs to be fleshed out and developed. But a second way to fail, a second way to fail anything is to not have a plan to not develop a detailed step-by-step -step path from where you are to where you want to be. That's a plan, a detailed step-by-step -step path. And if you don't have that detailed step-by-step -step path, you're, you're really operating in the realm of wishes and dreams and not goals and plans and objectives. So that's the second way you can fail anything. The third way to absolutely assure that you're going to fail Motivational video, the people that make those things, they'll, they'll appreciate this one. The way to absolutely assure you're going to fail, don't try. Don't do anything. Just, you know, it's too hard and walk away from it. Even if you set a realistic goal and even if you, if you, can, if you can foresee a set of, of doable steps between where you are and where you want to be, just don't do anything and you will absolutely fail. I, um, People say, "Well, I, you know, I didn't ask. You know, I didn't want. To, I didn't want to face rejection." Well, if you were trying to get a job and you didn't apply, you still don't have the job. So, you know, you didn't. You didn't get rejected, but you didn't get the job. And if and if the thing you were trying to do was get the job, if you don't apply, you don't have it. The, the, I have like my, a lot of my little life slogan things. The picture you don't take never comes out. You never get the job. picture you don't take never comes out. The, if you don't ask someone to go to the dance, you're going by yourself. And, and, or you're not going. And, and, and that's not to say, well, you know, I, I didn't want to fail, I didn't want to be rejected or whatever, so I didn't ask. And you're still by yourself. Or... If you say, well, you know, the assignment was too hard and, you know, I didn't want to get a bad grade, so I didn't do it. Now, how does that make sense? You didn't do it, so you're going to get a zero. Not doing something is de facto failing to achieve the thing that you didn't do, right? So you've got to face those fears. You've got to, you have got to get up and, and take those steps that makes sense in order to, to reach that goal. The video you don't post never gets any likes. The Instagram you don't post never gets any likes. The tweet you don't tweet never gets any shares. So so you can't not do something. Well you can if failures are if failure is what you're going for. If you're trying to if you're trying to be a failure, then don't do anything. So that's it. That's that's the three ways to fail. One, have an expectation, have a dream, have a have a thing that you're trying to do 
that is beyond reasonable. I'm going to go walk on Mars. I'm going to take a walk on Mars for, you know, spring break next year. Number two, don't don't come up with any don't come up with any concrete steps to get you from where you are to where you want to be. Just, you know, just wing it. Make it a wish, make it a dream. Don't make a plan. And and, and number three, oh, just don't do anything. Just sit back, do nothing. It, that will guarantee doing those three things or doing doing some of those three things will guarantee failure. So there's one thing you can be sure of. You never hit the shots you don't take. Bam. Thanks for watching. I hope you liked the video. Do the like, subscribe, share thing, leave me a comment. I uh, hope you enjoyed this. If you did, I hope to see you. Even if you didn't enjoy this, I still hope to see you in the next video. That's nah, probably got it. See, that's a telescope.